decisions being made, there are still more questions than answers on the catastrophe. And Russia's defence ministry is demanding information from Kiev, as Maria Fanoshina explains. Russia wants to know why the Ukrainian authorities believe that uh, the country's anti-government forces shut down the airplane. And while uh, the country's opposition doesn't have an air force, why Kiev deployed surface-to-air missiles in the area? And uh, Russia is also calling on Ukraine to release its records of the military tracking from the day of the tragedy. And Questions have also been uh, raised over why Kiev allowed the airliner to deviate from its course and fly over the battleground. These are the crucial issues that Russia's deputy defense minister believes Kiev should clarify for a better understanding of what uh, caused the tragedy. I would like to express deep condolences uh, to uh, all uh, people whose uh, relatives were died uh, in this uh, crash. I don't want to use this opportunity to blame anybody. I just would like to raise a few questions to my uh, uh, colleagues from armed forces of Ukraine. While the investigation continues, accusations are being thrown from every direction to every direction, and everybody understands that it should be done very carefully, otherwise consequences uh, could be very dramatic. But still we can see that there are more questions than answers in this tragic story.